Well, good day, everybody. It is Saturday, May 11th in downtown Nelson, and we're going to check out the 12th Annual Garden Festival, sponsored by the West Kootenai Eagle Society. It's always held on the same weekend as Mother's Day, and it's on the Saturday, the day before Mother's Day. So we're going to stroll around, take a few pics, just give you a bit of a feel and sensations of what it's like here. And then we'll track down a couple of the organizers. Hi, how's it going today? Good. We're just quickly going to scan the area. Pardon the glare. We're on Kootenai Street now, which comes off Baker. The main event is held on Baker Street. Beautiful day. It's coming. Yes, it is. Okay. Had to sign off there for a second, so we're just going to continue around the corner here. And here we have the beautiful, historic... Bank of Montreal building. And this part right here is the main part of the Garden Festival. Okay, let's take a little stroll and see who and what we meet here. It's a festive affair. It's all about plants and healthy living, pottery. Pretty good turnout. It's about 10.30 in the morning. What a preponderance of beautiful, lush, green plant life and human beings just smiling, basking in the beautiful West Kootenai sun. <laughs> and this is the end here. Just the corner of Baker and Fall Street. Look at this, chicken manure. Ooh, talk about foul language. Custom furniture. I'm so hot in my shoes, I can tell they're already going. There's about 55 vendors here this year. And they come from Nelson, they come from up the lake, they come from the Slocan Valley, I believe some might even come from Creston, Cranbrook. Trying to find the organizers. One of them is Susie Hamilton. She's around here somewhere. Thanks. In a good way. The truth came out. Tony. So, there you have it. A little glimpse and taste into the Nelson Garden Fest. Held every year in Nelson on Mother's Day weekend, the Saturday before that day. This is the Nelson Shimmy Mob. They're raising money for abused women. In Nelson.
Dawson, Castle Garden, our general area. This is part of the Garden Fest too. They're doing a special presentation this year. They're going to shim it up for us right here. Aha, uh -huh, and I finally located a couple of the two organizers for the Nelson Garden Fest here. On the left we have Susie Hamilton and on the right we have Maggie Jones. How are you doing ladies? Great. We're doing we're so happy. It is a wonderful day today. Yeah, good turnout yeah. today. It's wonderful. Fabulous. It's just getting more and more too. People come out. That's yeah. good. Well that's the purpose of these videos is to promote all the great events that are happening in and around Nelson so people are aware of it. Yeah. Now Susie, you've been involved in this since the beginning, right? Just about, yeah. Tell us a bit about it, how long it's been going on, who sponsors it and all that. Uh, it's been going on 12 years. The Eco Society started sponsoring it about in the third year and uh, we, we got a set up on Baker, that was the open door, and here we are in Baker 12 years later and 60 vendors. And this, but you know what, really the message is, all, most of these people are local food growers. Yeah. So look at, look at what we're supporting now. So it kind of ties in with our 100 mile diet. It, absolutely. It ties in with our sustainability. I mean, if we can support the people that are growing the plants for us to even put in our own garden. And heirloom varieties, unique varieties, um, varieties that do well in this um, yeah, this, uh, it's, a, this it's a great event. It, ha it has to do with healthy living and lifestyle, and and just getting getting to know your neighbors and supporting each other. And every year, there's always some special plant that shows up that there's a lot of. This year's basil. Basil yeah, is big this year. Basil. Isn't there's, no squash. there's no winter squash this year. Yeah. Very little so then next year there's going to be a lot of winter squash. 
Yes. Well, great. Okay, then, thanks a lot. And Susie, you're also involved with the Kokanee Park v Visitor Center, are you? Right, that's Tell right. us a bit about that. Well, the Eco Society took that over two years ago. We run it with grants and lots of volunteers. Hint, we're looking for volunteers. And we put on programs in the evening, through the day, for kids. We got a new kids' camp this year. And we, but the really special part that we found that we really hit the nail on the head was the Redfish Festival in August, third week in August, when we welcome the redfish to Kokanee Bay. They spawn. We, there, when they're spawning, we have naturalists taking people on tours up and down the channel. You wouldn't believe how many people that want great. to learn more about the redfish. So where do people, is there a website where they can go to find yeah. out about this? They can go to Kokanee Park, no, wait a minute, Kokanee Park, kokaneevisitorscenter.org or ecosociety.ca. So ecosociety.ca or Kokanee Visitors Center.org. Kokanee Center Visitors Center. Co yeah, Kokanee we'll Visitors Center.org. Yeah, and then on that we'll have the weekly schedules because like Tuesday nights are science in the park. Okay. Saturday night storytelling with all the storytellers. Well, we'll do a special feature on welovenelson.com about the Visitor Center. Yeah, wonderful. Well, I'll thanks a lot. Grand, I'll bring my grandkids over. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. That's and right, love. bring the kids over. So Cheers Kokanee Major, Park. Kokanee Park is about 12 miles yep, 14. east of Nelson. 14 miles? Yep, towards Balfour. Okay, towards Balfour. Yeah. Okay, thanks for all the great work you're doing. Thank you. See you next Bye. year. Bye. Bye. <laughs> well, that was nice to interview them. Now you know a little bit about the organizers. Across the street is another lovely musician here. Let's talk to these two lovely ladies who happen to be sisters here and entertaining the folks on Baker Street. Hi girls. Hi. And who are you? I'm Bronwyn and this is Neva. Bronwood and? Neva. Neva? Yeah. Are you Nelsonites? Uh, we just recently moved here in October. From, from where? From Victoria. From Victoria, the nation, the province's capital. Yeah. So are you classically trained? Um, yeah. Yes. But we're still in the progress of learning. And how do you like Nelson? Oh, it's a wonderful place. We really like yeah. it here. Well, it's a lot better since the two of you arrived. Oh, that's right. That's great. Thanks, Thanks a lot for your, for your fine music. Bye. It's going to be on We Love Nelson by tomorrow, probably. Wow.